with only barley malt, and brewed as an ale when wheat malt is added. In addition to the main style of Bach, several substyles exist, including, originally a dark beer, a modern Bach can range from light copper to brown in color. The style is very popular, with many examples brewed internationally. The style known now as Bach was a dark, malty, lightly hopped ale first brewed in the 14th century by German brewers in the Hanseatic town of Einbeck in Lower Saxony. The style from Einbeck was later adopted in Bavaria by Munich brewers in the 17th century and adapted to the new lager style of brewing. Due to their Bavarian accent, citizens of Munich pronounced Einbeck as Einbach, and thus the beer became known as Bach. As a visual pun, a goat often appears on Bach labels. Bach is historically associated with special occasions, often religious festivals such as Christmas, Easter or Lent. Bachs have a long history of being brewed and consumed by Bavarian monks as a source of nutrition during times of fasting. Traditional Bach is a sweet, relatively strong, lightly hopped lager. The beer should be clear, and color can range from light copper to brown, with a bountiful and persistent off-white head. The aroma should be malty and toasty, possibly with hints of alcohol, but no detectable hops or fruitiness. The mouthfeel is smooth, with low to moderate carbonation and no astringency. The taste is rich and toasty, sometimes with a bit of caramel. Again, hop presence is low to undetectable, providing just enough bitterness so that the sweetness is not cloying and the aftertaste is muted. The following commercial products are indicative of the style, Christmas Bach, Point Bach Einbecker Jorbach Dunkel, Pennsylvania Brewing Street. Nick Bach, Os Bach, Great Lakes Rockefeller Bach, Stegmeier Brewhouse Bach, and Nashville Brewing Company's Nashville Bach. The Maybach style, also known as Helles Bach or Heller Bach or even Lent Bach in the Netherlands, is a Helles lager brewed to Bach strength, therefore, still as strong as traditional Bach, but lighter in color and with more hop presence. It is a fairly recent development compared to other styles of Bach beers, frequently associated with springtime in the month of May. Color can range from deep gold to light amber with a large, creamy, persistent white head, and moderate to moderately high carbonation, while alcohol content ranges from 6. 3% to 7. 4% by volume. The flavor is typically less malty than a traditional Bach, and may be drier, hoppier, and more bitter, but still with a relatively low hop flavor, with a mild spicy or peppery quality from the hops, increased carbonation and alcohol content. The following commercial products are indicative of the style, Gunpowder Falls Brewing Company Maybach, Ainger Maybach, Marsbach, Hacker Store Hubertus Bach, Capital Maybach, Einbecker My Urbach, Hofbrau Maybach, Victory Street. Boisterous, Gordon Biersch Blonde Bach, Smutty Nose Maybach, Old Dominion Brewing Company Big Thaw Bach, Brewery 85's Quit in Time, Rogue Dead Guy Ale, Franconia Brewing Company Maybach Ale, Church Street Maybach, and Trogues Cultivator. Doppelbach or Double Bach is a stronger version of traditional Bach that was first brewed in Munich by the Paulana Friars, a Franciscan order founded by Street. Francis of Paula. Historically, Doppelbach was high in alcohol and sweet. The story is told that it served as liquid bread for the friars during times of fasting, when solid food was not permitted. However, historian Mark Dredge, in his book A Brief History of Lager, says that this story is myth, and that the monks produced Doppelbach to supplement their order's vegetarian diet all year. Today, Doppelbach is still strong, ranging from 7% to 12% or more by volume. It is clear, with color ranging from dark gold, for the paler version, to dark brown with ruby highlights for darker version. It has a large, creamy, persistent head. The aroma is intensely malty, with some toasty notes, and possibly some alcohol presence as well, darker versions may have a chocolate-like or fruity aroma. The flavor is very rich and malty, with noticeable alcoholic strength, and little or no detectable hops. Paler versions may have a drier finish. The monks who originally brewed Doppelbach named their beer Salvatore, which today is trademarked by Paulana. Brewers of modern Doppelbachs often add Ottor to their beer's name as a signpost of the style. There are 200 Ottor Doppelbach names registered with the German Patent Office. The following are representative examples of the style Paulana Salvatore, Ainger Celebrator, Weinstefaner Corbinian, Andexer Doppelbach Dunkel, Spot and Optimator. Augustiner Brau Maximator, Tuckerbadjuvator, Weltenberger Kloster Ossenbach, Capital Autumnal Fire, Eku 28, Eggenberg Urbach 23 degrees, Bells Consecrator. Moretti La Rosa, Samuel Adams Double Bach, Trogues Troganator Double Bach, Wasatch Brewery Devastator, 
Great Lakes Doppel Rock, Abita Andy Gator. Wolverine State Brewing Company Predator, Burley Bruins Berlinator, Monteith's Doppelbach, and Christian Moorline Emancipator Doppelbach. Icebach beer, made by removing ice from partially frozen barrels of beer, resulting in a higher alcohol content Icebach is a traditional specialty beer of the Kolmbach district of Bavaria. Germany, made by partially freezing a Doppelbach and removing the water ice to concentrate the flavor and alcohol content, which ranges from 9% to 13% by volume. It is clear, with a color ranging from deep copper to dark brown in color, often with ruby highlights. Although it can pour with a thin off-white head, head retention is frequently impaired by the higher alcohol content. The aroma is intense, with no hop presence, but frequently can contain fruity notes, especially of prunes, raisins, and plums. Mouthfeel is full and smooth, with significant alcohol, although this should not be hot or sharp. The flavor is rich and sweet, often with toasty notes, and sometimes hints of chocolate, always balanced by a significant alcohol presence. The following are representative examples of the style, Colorado Team Brew Warning Sign, Kolmbacher Reichelbrau Eisbach, Egenberg, Schneider Aventinius Eisbach, Urbach Dunkel Eisbach, Franconia Brewing Company Eisbach 17%. The strongest ice beer, strength in numbers, was a one-time collaboration in 2020 between Skorschbrau of Germany and Brewdog of Scotland, who had competed with each other in the early years of the 21st century to produce the world's strongest beer. Strength in Numbers was created using traditional ice distillation, reaching a final strength of 57. 8% ABV. Weizenbach is a style of Bach that replaces some of the barley in the grain bill with 40-60% to wheat. It was first produced in Bavaria in 1907 by G. Schneider and Sohn and was named Aventinius after a Bavarian historian. The style combines darker Munich malts and top fermenting wheat beer yeast, brewed at the strength of a Doppelbach. Thanks for watching.